Hi everyone, um, so I'm going to do a wash video for you. It's going to be quite a simple wash video. My hair's really gross. Um, I literally haven't washed it in days because of everything that's been going on and having to come to uh, terms with homeschooling and things like that. That's been a massive challenge. Um, so this is what it looks like. You know, there's still a little curl in there, but it's not um, what you call great curl, bit of frizz. It just feels built up now and heavy and not that great. Um, yeah, so I'll do a simple one and then I'm going to talk you through some products your way. Um, and then today um, I'm just going to wash it. I'll show you how I put the product, what products I use and how I put them in. Um, dry it and then that's it. It does actually need a treatment. It could do with a protein treatment or something. Um, I've just sort of abandoned it. I have refreshed it with conditioner but nothing else. So uh, we'll see how it reacts today to just having a simple wash rather than having a treatment which it, it actually does need. as much as I can to leave it air dry mostly and then I usually finish it off with a diffuser um, and just because I know loads of you are going to ask me <clears throat> this is a hair dryer Babyliss Pro you can't see can you see the Pro Babyliss Pro it's a professional one um, I'm pretty certain you'll be able to get it online though not just from wholesalers and then this diffuser is the one I used um, Keep it cool as much as you can though. If you can, if you've got the time for it, keep it on the, the like lukewarm heat as much as you can throughout drying your hair. That's what I did because um, otherwise you'll just over dry it. And then when you know that your ends are dry, just go through the hair. Don't go, don't keep going from the bottom up because you'll over dry the ends. And Okay, so I'm gonna let it dry properly a minute. Let's like give it 10 minutes to settle. That's why it might look a bit crazy at the moment. Um, and then I'm gonna shake it all out. Um, as you all know, my favorite shampoo, the co-wash. Um, I used, I co-washed it twice today because it really needed a good scrub. Um, so when you use this, you need to scrub a lot harder. Remember to really work it through the hair top, bottom in with the Aveda Cherry Almond Conditioner. Um, smells amazing, literally smells like cherry almonds. 
So you don't like marzipan. <laughs> you might not like this, but it's worked really well on my hair today. Um, like I said, I thought I needed a treatment, but um, it's come out quite well. So I'm quite left some of the cherry almond conditioner in. Not too much, because it is slightly heavier. <clears throat> and then I went in with the Aveda Style Prep. Um, probably a good altogether 10p dollop um, raked all the way through the curls top to bottom everywhere just not in no not that one this one Aveda be curly curl enhancer this one isn't for everyone guys if you've got quite fine limp hair don't use this um, and if you have got hair like mine just a small amount you just want a tiny amount coating your hair and it can fix the gel to lock it all in and then to help me get my root volume, which I'm going to do in a minute, I can feel it in there. Texture tonic. This one is incredible for anybody with fine curls, limp curls, people that don't get much volume in their curls. Um, it's just going to make them pop and get really big. Anyone with hair texture like mine, it's a fine amount, otherwise you'll want to wash your hair too soon. Um, it gives it like a grippy feel. Okay. Shake out time. Just literally in at the roots. Yeah. Jake! Are you finished work? Okay. Do that! Uh, <laughs> Go on then. Come here. Do that! <laughs> Say hi. Hi, Bats. <laughs> okay, so I'm all done now. Um, one more exciting thing that I need to tell you is that I've got a great idea which I'm going to let you all know about next week but it means I'm going to be able to tailor things a lot easier to you. Um, I don't let you all, I don't put what I use on all my pictures because it might not suit you all and then you might go and spend say hundred plus pounds on products that aren't right for your hair so I've got a really cool um, idea and we have to be creative in times like this when we're shut for business. Um, so I'm going to launch that hopefully next week. It's going to take me a little bit of time to get together and then all of you can um, Hopefully I have access to all the products that will be amazing for you um, and you'll know exactly how to use them. So more information on that coming very soon. He's been standing still and quiet for me. He's been brilliant. Come and say goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Bye guys.